When you think of fast food, one name stands out above the rest, McDonald's. But behind the golden arches is the story of a man who saw potential in a small burger restaurant and turned it into a global empire. Ray Kroc wasn't the founder of McDonald's, but his vision and drive transformed it into one of the most recognizable brands in the world. In today's episode, we explore how Ray Kroc built the McDonald's empire and revolutionized the fast food industry forever. Ray Kroc was born in 1902 in Oak Park, Illinois. Before he became the mastermind behind McDonald's, Kroc held a series of odd jobs, from selling paper cups to working as a pianist. But it was his job as a traveling salesman that would change his life forever. In 1954, while selling milkshake machines, Kroc came across a small, successful hamburger restaurant run by the McDonald brothers in San Bernardino, California. Impressed by the efficiency and popularity of the McDonald brothers' operation, Kroc saw an opportunity to expand their concept. He convinced the brothers to let him franchise the brand, with dreams of turning McDonald's into a national and eventually global phenomenon. Ray Kroc wasn't just focused on making burgers, he was focused on building a system. Kroc developed a strict set of standards for McDonald's franchises, ensuring that no matter where you went, a McDonald's burger tasted the same. He introduced innovations like the assembly line food preparation, speedy service, and consistent branding, all hallmarks of the fast food industry we know today. Kroc's vision was to create a consistent customer experience across all McDonald's locations. By 1961, Kroc had bought out the McDonald brothers for $2.7 million, giving him total control of the company. From there, he expanded aggressively, opening hundreds of new locations and cementing McDonald's as the leader in fast food. But Kroc's ambitions didn't stop at America's borders. He had his sights set on making McDonald's a global brand. In 1967, the first international McDonald's opened in Canada, followed by Puerto Rico. By the 1970s, McDonald's had expanded into Europe, Asia, and beyond, introducing its menu and service style to new cultures while adapting to local tastes. With each new market came unique challenges, but Kroc's ability to standardize operations while allowing for local adaptations made McDonald's a universal success. Whether you're in New York, Tokyo, or Paris, you'll recognize the Golden Arches and the iconic Big Mac. Ray Kroc's impact on the fast food industry cannot be overstated. His vision for McDonald's not only made it the largest restaurant chain in the world but also set the standard for fast food business models that others would follow. Today, McDonald's serves over 69 million people daily in more than 100 countries, and the fast food model Kroc perfected, quick, affordable, consistent meals, is the foundation of the global fast food industry. While Ray Kroc was a master of efficiency and scaling, his methods were not without controversy. Many criticized him for his aggressive business tactics, including the way he pushed out the original McDonald brothers. Yet there's no denying that he built a business empire that transformed how the world eats. Ray Kroc's journey from milkshake machine salesman to fast food mogul is a testament to his entrepreneurial spirit and relentless ambition. By seeing the potential in a small burger joint, Kroc didn't just build a restaurant chain, he built a global empire. If you enjoyed this look at Ray Kroc's rise to power, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more stories of history's greatest business empires. In our next episode, we'll explore another visionary entrepreneur who reshaped the world of business. Who will it be? Stay tuned to find out.